guys, I'm not avoiding making YouTube videos or anything like that. It's just been, I'm not just kind of been doing my thing, taking care of business. And uh, I'm probably not even going to stop in New Mexico today, but welcome to New Mexico. There we go, a new state. Cool. I never seem to spend much time in New Mexico because it's so cold up north. I just stay as south as possible. Uh, I'm not going to stay on I-10 much longer. In fact, not much longer at all. I'm going to get into Arizona today and then take some back road, back roads that I've never been on and try to find some camping up in the mountains. Uh, but yeah, we'll see what today holds. Jax will uh, hide the catnip until we get through. Me right through that was cool I know there's a lot of different feelings on these border inspections let me just for once maybe just say what I think so like I understand the purpose of trying to keep drugs from crossing the border or to even human smuggling to keep that from happening some people don't like the fact that it's an invasion of privacy for US citizens because well, we haven't even crossed the border we haven't done anything I've got nothing to hide. I'm not doing anything wrong or illegal, so it kind of makes me feel good sometimes that they go to those lengths to protect our country. And I know, I know, I'm going to get lots and lots of flack for that because, like I said, the people who don't like these border controls, they really, really, really don't like them. And here I am saying I don't care. I, I literally don't care. I don't care. They're doing a, a service, and they're not harming U.S. citizens. Um, so I don't know. That's my feeling. Sorry. I should know better than stating an opinion on YouTube. Ah! All right, well, I kind of fell for a little tourist trap stop here in New Mexico, but it's all good. I need a gas, and uh, it's colorful. It's kind of cool. It's all just, you know, for show and stuff, just to try to get people in to buy stuff. It's still cool. Uh, I got to get back on the road. Getting lots of sun here in New Mexico. That's cool, but um, that's still cold. Yeah, I want to get back in and turn the heat on. This is a really neat rest area here in Gage, New Mexico. It's really sunny, and they have these little shelter areas for day use. And uh, just like Texas, it says you can stay here for up to 24 hours. So you can camp here overnight. Again, I'm not going to. I feel like I've been trying to, not trying to, but I feel like I've been isolating myself a lot lately, which is fine. It's just, it's gotten to the point where I don't know. Ever since, I just, I don't know. <laughs> I just don't want to hang out with people. I don't, I, don't know, I don't know what's up with that. I just feel, I feel like lately I'm happier just to kind of do my own thing and get away from civilization where I don't have to deal with crumb and crap and <sighs> kind of bring Jax out, make some lunch and uh, have lunch right here. I'll let Jax eat first. There you go. Jax, right here. There's your lunch. So 
what's on the menu here for me for lunch. I'm doing a Lazy Bachelor grilled ham and cheese. Absolutely love it. Got some strawberries and some cold milk. Easy, simple, and satisfying. Mm -hmm. These succulents and cacti did okay. Uh, I'm just tired of looking at them. I'm tired of looking at the planner. Don't like the memories, so <laughs> I'm gonna start over. Do something different that I don't have an emotional attachment to. Maximus Maximus, you ready to get back on the road and go places? All right, buddy, that's some more driving to do. We've got one other state we got to get into today, okay? You get my lap? Get some lap. Oh, you don't want lap? Okay. Just want to sit next to me? Okay. I got to get driving. Here we go. Sit down. Are you buckled? You're not buckled. Why aren't you buckled? Okay. Thanks for the kisses, but you gotta you gotta secure yourself, buddy. <laughs> there <you> go. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. I love this cat. I'm gonna pull off and get gas here at this flying J here in uh, Lordsburg, New Mexico, because it's 2.15 a gallon, and gas prices are gonna jump uh, 30 cents once I get into Arizona. There's no avoiding it, but I can at least top off my tank now. This is where I'm getting off of I-10 anyway, because I'm gonna stick to uh, Highway 70, different route west, in the boonies. Plus, I might get lucky and find some water. Matter of fact. I'm not a superstitious person, at least I don't think I am. But I didn't realize I put $50 in there and I pumped $43.34. I went in there to get my change and he said, uh-oh, your change is 666, 666. And I said, well, wait a minute, wait a minute. I think I can pump a little more gas. <laughs> I just didn't want to do it. So I came out here and uh, topped off and uh, got $6 back instead. <laughs> Yeah, this is uh, U.S. Highway 70 West. As you can see, it's uh, a little different than I-10. Speed limit 55. I like it. I like it a lot more. If I happen to see a car anytime in the next hour, uh, he can certainly pass me if he wanted to. But this is just cool. Some BLM land uh, that we're going to be going through here, so. I would suspect that that's where Jax and I call our final destination for the day. I'll let you know when I see something cool though. Hey, Jax, man, what do you think of our spot? It's pretty cool. Very peaceful out here. Now I'm gonna refrain from giving out the exact GPS locations here live in this video, because I don't know how long I'm gonna stay here. But eventually, when I leave, you can check the video description below and uh, I will have this exact little campsite I love the mountains in the distance, though. So most likely in my very next video, I'll talk more about this, but this is BLM land here in Arizona, which is free to use. It's basically called dispersed primitive camping, and uh, you can stay in one spot for up to 14 days. 
So tilt the panels. Got Wi-Fi out here so I can watch Netflix and YouTube. Upload a video and just kind of enjoy it. But the quiet and peace is much desired by me. So <sighs> it's just crazy. Crazy. All right. You guys have a great day, night, morning, whenever you're watching this, and um, I'll get back with you in a couple days. All right, I hope that video turned out well. That was a lot of work for just one pass by. <laughs> oh man, it's nice and quiet out here though. <laughs> hey guys, this is Jax, my kitty cat. I'm his servant, Eric. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel here on RVing. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up below. Make sure you subscribe, check out all our other videos and keep following us on the road. Thanks guys.